What's going on, Clint? Squat! What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Dup. It's your boy, Ross. This is Clint's going rogue. Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, with the bitches today. You feel me? Men ignore attention sinking OnlyFans girl. Crazy. Hey, that's a. Fellas, be wise to the trickery. Be very wise. Because it's out there, man. So, you know what I'm saying? Don't fall for it. Don't De- fall for it. On the, the daily, dog. man. You better make sure you keeping your head on a swivel. Woo, woo, woo. You Gosh. feel me? But we're about to get into this right now. Shout out to the homie Arco TV. Keep on running up them likes, subscribing, and. You must stay focused. You must stay just focused. Look here. Fact. Look at the atmosphere. <laughs> she thought. That's why you got somebody like recording. Mm-hmm. But these just <laughs> no one cares. <laughs> the way some of these girls are so desperate for attention it's actually become funny this is comedy the way she's walking around with a camera behind her in the tightest dress and she's gone to a place where they do construction thinking she's gonna get a bunch of guys mm-hmm. looking at her and whistling at her and they barely reacted and i'm sure a few of them made a few comments when you walk past but i think a lot of them now are just gonna see straight through it and know you're doing it for videos people in the comments noticed as well it says nobody looked not a single wolf whistle pick me right. love me more pick, like watch yep. me pay for my only fans because all our videos are the same just her walking down the street oh. Oh, okay. dress and then they're linked to her only fans quick oh. video of me while i walk past these men no one looked the men knew she was trying so they didn't look when you're on a red carpet and nobody takes a photo because i guess they don't think you're hot enough oh that's cold whoops <laughs> she said, whoops what the hell sensational <laughs> feminism <laughs> leaving our bodies when it comes to carrying our heavy suitcase anywhere <laughs> Oh my god, I thank you so much. Huh. I bet it is leaving your body. Are the chlamydia meds gorgeous? Better? What? Just take the damn medicine and you go about your day, bro. This shit weird. Why are they no. so gorgeous? She said the chlamydia. Yeah, I know. I know what she said. Just take the I'm shit. I'm on that part. No. Take, hey, man. Take the shit. Get the shit covered. Move on, bro. It's the fact that you recorded it. Jeez. Question, why are you so comfortable on the internet? I just felt like yeah. that was more deserving of a diary as opposed to a TikTok video. Yep. So you want to know something that's really gorgeous? A negative test for chlamydia. It's impossible for women after 40 to find a boyfriend. I have no children. I cook delicious food and have a big house. Am I really that bad? Someone said, don't worry, it gets worse. <laughs> Bro, it's stupid. Oh, oh he got you. Yeah. At the same time. Oh, yeah, we did it. <laughs> <laughs> get a go. Yeah. Get a go. Get a body, girl. Get a body. <laughs> Therapists the when they see a girl with blue oh, hair. Comes the money. Yep. Here we go. Joey. Creator. Oh, sweetie, you are. You have a great talent for creating difficult situations. Oh, I do. sure. <laughs> <laughs> My boyfriend says he loves me in a week. Monday four. He broke up with me. He called. If we talk, <laughs> you ain't single. We're in a pending relationship. Oh, You're in pending. the cart right now. You're in the cart. Getting ready to check out. <laughs> yep. Don't be cheating on me. <laughs> Don't be cheating on me. <laughs> cart. Some girl told daddy they like his hair. Oh. Yeah. Okay, and what did daddy say? <laughs> Oh, he smiled. <laughs> oh, he smiled. He want to smile at girls now. Okay, so your daddy trying to meet Jesus today. Yeah, please sleep, and brother. I'll try and sleep for another Dog. two or three weeks. You seem upset. I am upset. Why are you upset? I'm a queen. Why are you trying to tell me about my ex-boyfriend, who I'm still close friends with? So you do care about him? Yeah, but I don't want to. I just don't want a family with him. So I don't understand why you guys can are trying to tell me about my relationship. We're not trying to tell you about your relationship. But We're just trying to tell you how men think. Here's the thing. I'm going to be cool and fun, but I'm not going to be talked to like I'm stupid. Yeah, but we're I'm not talking to you like you're stupid, though. Yeah, you were. How? Because we told you that your your man wants to fuck you. And but I... I'm sure he does, but he also has expressed multiple times that he wants to start family with me. But you understand? Lie, right? <laughs> I went through his phone. It doesn't matter, though. I'm a 32-year-old woman. You don't. 
So don't insult <laughs> my intelligence. You're not going to invite me on this podcast and insult my intelligence. Hey, we're little crocodile tears from the start because you can't switch up your tone that quick. Come on, you're really bro. upset. She didn't like what she was being told and she thought if I cry, then he's going to stop telling me. But when he didn't stop, then yeah, she McQueen don't care, about Yeah, he don't. Like he don't give a damn, bro. Like a little baby. <laughs> Become Lil Wayne's videographer, but you got to end your marriage. Or never meet Lil Wayne. Stay happily married. Oh, I was in love with Lil Wayne way before I loved my wife. <laughs> POV, um, you go on a date with a car guy. <laughs> oh, that was the event where I saw. Some people think that women's basketball isn't entertaining, but you can't watch this Utah chick miss two free throws with her team down by one and 4.7 seconds left and tell me this isn't the funniest thing you've seen in a while. You can tell all of her teammates have zero confidence in her and know she's bricking the second one after her first air ball. And videos like this just prove that almost anyone can play Division I women's basketball because even I would have hit at least one of those free throws. Megan Rapino and Sue Bird have both come out opposed to a bill that would keep men from competing as women's athletes. This is crazy. Megan Rapino has made her career trying to argue for equal pay for women, and now she's going to create a situation where a man could take a women's job. The U.S. women, that is the world championship women's U.S. soccer team, lost to a team mm -hmm. of 15 and under boys in mm -hmm. Dallas. Barely post-puberty boys in one city in America <laughs> smoked the U.S. Smoked. women's soccer team. If men who identify as women, women are allowed to play women's soccer, eventually there would be no women on the U.S. women's soccer team. <laughs> this is absolutely the opposite of women's feminism. You can see straight through this mega muppet. All she's trying to do is look like a good person and pander to the people that support her. So it's an empty stupid. fake gesture and if she does mean it, That's she's exposed wild, herself because it means she doesn't really care about women's sports. Let's have a look at this photo of a cyclist standing on top of the winning podium. Let's see if we can just uh, de decode this one. Decode. Uh, transgender cyclist forced to stand alone on the podium after a win. Wonder why that would be. Oh, mm. hang on. It's a bloke and the girls, the Sheilas, refuse to stand next to him. James. Mm. Well, we're seeing more and more of this. Yeah. Uh, and uh, I think that for a lot of the, you know, lunacy <sighs> around this ideology to end, <laughs> we're going to need to start seeing people who are competing in these sports say, no, you know what, I'm sorry, but I'm not going to validate what's happening here. Well, yep. uh, it was close because uh, this person um, competing in the women's event <laughs> won by 17 minutes. <laughs> Third place was 30 minutes behind. So, right. Uh, yeah. But there's no, there's no comparative advantage. Oh, there's no advantage. This lunacy you know. defeats itself, but it is great when women... Women have to say no to this stuff. I've heard a lot of people, and I think I've even said before, why don't we make a category just for trans people? But even if we do that, it still wouldn't make sense, would it? Because you still have men and women. You wouldn't be able to mix them all together because there'd still be some that went through puberty as men and some that didn't. And I was thinking, if we keep allowing this madness to happen in sports, we're just going to be left with men. There's going to be no women competing <laughs> anymore. You know, I was thinking the other day, I'm only 29 years old. I might just identify as a woman and become a footballer, bruv. I might just go play for Arsenal. Bang in 50 goals, get a Ballon d'Or. <laughs> No. Here, I don't have my wallet. <laughs> have you ever cheated? Yes. <laughs> yes, I have. What did you do? <laughs> Microphone. Like, like, what did you do to cheat? <laughs> I mean... Don't care if she cheats. She belongs, she belongs to the streets. streets. <laughs> don't, don't matter. Oh. It don't matter what you talking about. Doesn't matter. After, After all. <laughs> hey, man, at the end of the day, man, <laughs> you know where they belong in, bro. There's a lot of conversations that people are entertaining, Sweet, but, man. you know, I know the real to it. We ain't going to have it here right now. But if y'all enjoyed the video, make sure you want to <laughs> like and subscribe. Let us know mm -hmm. what else we need to be checking out. Keep on supporting the channel. Road to 100K. Almost there, baby. Keep on running it up for us, man. Continue to spread love, be love. Catch y'all in the next one. Peace. All right, man. This bitch is from Houston. If she got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me because I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside, they know they can't handle half of me.